Hey guys, how's it going? In today's video, I'm gonna show you a quick and easy way to get from Montreal Airport to Central Montreal. So you just arrived in Montreal Airport. You've got your bag, you're walking out, and this is what you see. To your right, you're gonna see a ridiculously long lineup of people waiting for Tim Hortons. And to your left, you're gonna see taxi cabs, which can take you to Central Montreal for I don't know, probably about $80 or something like that. But assuming you don't want a coffee and you don't want to pay 80 bucks, there is an easy option that is significantly cheaper. All you gotta do is walk straight down the hall until you're almost at the end of the terminal and then you're gonna see this. It's easy to remember because it's 747, just like the airplanes, the 747s. So how this works is you go to the machine, it defaults to French, you can switch to English if you like. And then you're gonna say non-rechargeable card, unless you've been here before. And you're gonna do zone A 24 hours. Now, what this gets you is not only a trip to downtown Montreal, but this is actually gonna be good for any other metro for the next 24 hours. It's gonna cost 11 bucks. It's gonna get you the 747 bus ride. It's gonna get you a train ride to downtown Montreal if that's what you're looking for. And you're also gonna have this pass, which you can keep using for the rest of the day. So it's, it's pretty cool. Cash, credit card, all the usual stuff. Pretty easy. Card goes in over here. Once you've paid, your ticket will come down here. Now, I already have my pass. That's why I didn't buy one. But once you have your pass, all you have to do is walk out to your left. I'll take this door here. And then you see those buses? Those are the 747 buses. So if you're confused, if you can't see the buses, you just gotta walk all the way to the right. Follow the signs for the 747. By the way, this is what your ticket looks like, okay? Very important you have this before you go to the bus, they cannot sell you your ticket on the bus. Also, sometimes you'll see multiple buses and you might think, okay, I'm just gonna step on that bus, which is stopped. But you actually need to go to the lineup, which is in this little thing to the side here. So don't get confused and go on this bus. So even if there's a lineup, don't worry, it goes quick. This bus is gonna take you to somewhere called Lionel Gru, which is one of the metro stations. So make sure you hold on to this, because you can also use this to take the metro to any part of Montreal you wanna get to. This one's pretty full, I'm gonna wait for the next one. So that last bus was pretty full, so I waited for the next one. It took about 10 or 15 minutes, but here we are with an empty bus. You can see they got places you can put your suitcases. So the last stop of this bus, I think it's the last stop, but you're gonna tell because it's where everyone gets off, is Lionel Bru. Um, and then from there, I'll show you how to shortly walk from there to the metro, which is like just down the street. And from there, as long as you know what station you're going to, you can go anywhere in downtown Montreal. Okay, and just like that, we are out of the bus and right across from it, you can see this gray building. There's a 747, there is the metro. Not the prettiest building, but as they say, beauty's on the inside. And remember, this same $11 fare is gonna get you on the trains anywhere you wanna go. Uh, I'll show you quickly what the map looks like, but you're going to have to figure this part out on your own. If you're going to downtown Montreal, you might be going to somewhere like McGill or Peel Station. So this is us here. Connects to the orange line. Connects to the green line. I'm taking the orange line today, so I'm going down here. Hope this video was helpful. And by the way, I have a whole playlist of videos from Montreal. If you're watching this, I assume you're visiting Montreal. Check out my playlist where you're going to see a lot of neighborhood tours, uh, best foods to eat, best places to visit. I think you'll like what you find. As always, I'm Dan. I'll catch you next time.